St. Martin. Yeah, it looked kind of crazy. My hair like looks insane. But we're here. I'm gonna get myself together and I'm gonna give you a proper intro. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Rincy. I make lifestyle, beauty, vlogs, travel vlogs. And today I have a travel vlog for y'all. We are in St. Martin. I showed y'all, I gave y'all like a little room tour. Really, I just showed y'all my little cute setup that I walked into. Um, but I got myself together. I put on a little outfit. I just have on this crop top and some shorts, honestly. Nothing crazy and some shades. And we're about to go and explore. So yeah, let's go look around. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is our first official full day in St. Martin. Um, yesterday, I stopped recording after we ate at the Sunset Bar, but we ended up going out. We went to Nowhere Special. We'll definitely be going back there, so I'll probably get a better recording when we go next time. But look at the views, y'all. The views are stunning. Elevator's here. She has it's so pretty out here in the morning y'all look at this we're about to go by the pool catch a vibe by the pool i'm just wearing a black swimsuit and then the black pants cover up and yeah we're about to chillax by the pool today probably go to maho beach it's literally right next to our resort um if you want to if you're coming to st martin it's a few resorts but um the morgan resort is actually really nice very peaceful if you're looking for like a calm vibe i would say come here i can't speak on other resorts like if it's more turn up but it's a strip that has like a bunch of lounges restaurants stuff like that if you want to turn up you'll get a turn up and then we're gonna eat something we might go back downstairs to eat um because i think they're about to have lunch soon it's about to be noon um and then um i can show you all the food that they have at the restaurant if you stay here because um like i think i said in the beginning it's not an all-inclusive resort um so they have the bars down there and then they have a restaurant as well so we might eat there since we ate at the sunset bar yesterday 
and then we might go to another beach mullet beach um mullet bay beach i think is what it's called so yeah i will let you guys know when we're doing something else okay y'all we're at salt but now we're here to try the food last night we just had drinks so is it on here no um she was right i was wrong but it smelled like jerk though don't it here's the menu guys some might say it's very americanized go local but you don't want nothing from here you want to get like an appetizer or something let me show you this same spot. drink is yesterday y'all it's so dark over here or maybe it's my shades <laughs> and they try one too and then we just got We've been chicken weaning it up. Like last night, we had chicken wings when we went to Nowhere Special. We had chicken wings when we first got here. But we want to try some local. The wings you want this spicy, right? Yeah. And there's this place called Rainbow Cafe that I really wanted to go to, but they say they're temporarily closed. So I have to get that off of my mind. I wanted to try that. Um, but I have a bunch of other places like I have wrote down well typed a bunch of places to go in St. Martin um, so yeah we're just eating this for right now since we haven't ate anything all day I hear wet at the end and it's 12 17 what's this spicy barbecue wings and french fries on the side and this is the Caribbean punch I highly recommend it's really good kind of like refreshing um, yeah, this is the food we got. It's just like a little appetizer. The whole beach, y'all, is deep over here. And this isn't even like the half. It's like people all down there by the restaurant we ate yesterday. And people come right here, obviously, to be at the beach. But you can see the airplanes fly over to the airport. Yep. So this is the little strip area by Maho Beach. We just passed, y'all saw the airplane fly past. But here they have like a bunch of different restaurants, lounges, and stuff like that. We just made it to Mullet Bay Beach. Thank you. 
Food, eight ounce steak, lobster mac and cheese. Comes with a side of fries or mashed potatoes. And yeah, and then these are mango spicy margaritas. Hey y'all, it is day three in St. Martin. And I just showed you guys my passport and my ticket because today we're going to St. Bart's. So we're getting out of St. Martin and we're going to another island today. Um, and we're just waiting to um, board our ferry. We booked it online. Um, and I know I'll probably get questions in the video, I mean under the comments. Um, book it through the hotel. So whether you stay at Morgan or whatever resort, book it through them and they'll tell you. All right, y'all, so we boarded the ferry. Um, we're sitting up top. See the views? Yeah, we're sitting at the top. People are trying to see Martin. And then we have to go to Crescent Falls to get our stamp in St. Clark's. plans just vibes you feel me no plans just vibes um it's a bunch of like shops and restaurants over here so we're gonna chill over here for a little bit walk around and explore and then i think we're gonna go to nikki beach a little later on we took the earliest ferry and then we're taking the latest ferry to go back let's go backwards because the light is better this way it seems but we're just walking around still um they have a bunch of like designer and luxury stores down here as well like louis cartier all that all that jazz prada i think i showed prada we went to chrome heart um so yeah we're just walking around gonna see what food to eat see what they food talking about for real so we'll see your body drive me crazy. Your body need a license fit. Your body are too tight and neat. Anybody who got eyes can see. She just wanna dance and tease. She just wanna dance and tease. She just wanna dance and tease me. She just wanna dance and tease me. She just wanna dance and tease me. Listen, you've been missing since 2006. Squid tell me one fix. You know that's my sister. When she speak, I listen. She swears you're my missing. I say we think different. Love me a good seat, sorry. <laughs> For real. For real. St. Martin, we're still in St. Bart's. But um, 
I'm gonna give a little review of Nikki Beach. It was really good. The food was 10 out of 10, would recommend. It is pricey. I think I said that earlier, like this island is more on the expensive side. Um, so if you are visiting St. Martin, I mean, you could stay just in St. Martin, but um, there are ferries that take you to St. Bart's, Anguilla, and like nearby islands and stuff like that. So um, Nikki Beach was really good. I really enjoyed the food. We had the quesadillas. Um, we got a Caesar salad chef's kiss um and then we had pizza and my boyfriend had like this sesame chicken rice thing or whatever and the drinks were good too but you know just keep in mind if you are going to come to st bart's it is a little more expensive than being in st martin or i think any of the other islands i can't really speak for anguilla because um we didn't go there but we might i don't know we might go there one of these days just because we can go um and spend you can literally go um like on the ferry with some people that like come and stay are going to stay at the resorts here or you can do like a day here and the ferry will take you there and back if you book a round trip um but yeah i just wanted to give you guys my little review of nikki beach i really enjoyed it um my boyfriend enjoyed the food as well and yeah we're just gonna chill we probably walk around and look at some of the stores again until it's time to go back which we have a little while until it's time to go back 6 6 45 so yeah that's my little review for nikki beach <laughs> Day four in St. Martin. To the locals. We can go to the locals later. Okay. Um, yeah, right now we're just chilling. About to relax by the pool. I forgot where I left off yesterday. Oh, I think I showed you guys. We shopped a little bit. We got, um, we went to the Creed Boutique. Um, and yeah, I think that's where I left off at. We were supposed to go out last night and then we fell asleep. Like, we were like, we're gonna take a nap and then get up, go back out. My alarm never went off woke up it was like two in the morning now we could have still went out because um in st martin they don't go to sleep but we just were like okay forget it like tonight we're out we're outside it's saturday so yeah tonight we'll be outside but yeah y'all just wanted to give you guys a little update since i haven't talked to y'all in like hours and hours and hours For drinks, we want to do the two of the Caribbean punches, and then for we're gonna do the Sun over St. Martin. Okay, and then we'll do bacon for the meat. Yeah. Okay. And that's all. All right. What room number? Um, 317. Okay, I just asked that just to have it for the system, but I don't charge. The okay. Room. Okay. And then I just need it. You're welcome. Hi, honey. Yeah, he's a fish. Mm -hmm. My background looks good. Mm -hmm. They managed to not have them in the main. We're in Phillipsburg, y'all. And we're by the beach. The beach. Oh, they have chairs and stuff out here, too. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Y'all, we left Front Street. Now we're at Skip Jacks. It is the waiting and the thing. There we go. <laughs> Food's here, y'all. What is this? Crab bags. Crab bags. Big for the big bags. Fries. <laughs> crab cake. Crab cake. <laughs> and crab dip. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. 
It's the last official day of the trip in St. Martin and today we're planning to go to Anguilla. Um, I think I told you guys that we might do that like earlier in the vlog, but we just got ready. We're waiting on our taxi. That's what I'm wearing. Y'all can't really see it all too well, but I have a swimsuit on, the skims top, cover up, and like the this head thing matches my actual swimsuit as you can see. Um, but yeah, we're waiting on a taxi to take us to the port so we can try to go there to go to Anguilla. I'll let you guys know how that thing works. This ride is a little shorter. It says it's like 15 to 20 or 25, 20 to 25 minutes. So, um, yeah. I'll let y'all know once we get on the ferry. It's the Four Seasons, and y'all, let me show y'all this view because it is gorgeous. It is freaking gorgeous. Do y'all see this? Water. This beautifulness. It's so pretty. But yeah. First stop is Four Seasons. We have reservations at Sabi Beach at 12.30. And we're trying to see about getting this car called the Moki. Like, it's like a, I don't know. I'll show y'all. If we get it, I'll show y'all what it looks like. Um, but we're thinking about just chilling here for a little bit and then we're gonna go eat, just vibe and taking the views because it is freaking gorgeous here, y'all. This water is so pretty. I highly recommend going to St. Martin. And if you're gonna go for a few days, visit the islands that are close. Another view for y'all. Look at these chairs, they're so cool. I thought they were just like statues, but they're chairs. This island is so pretty. And this hotel or resort, whatever you wanna call it, is really nice, but obviously it's nice because it's the Four Seasons, okay? So we're having appetizer. At Four Seasons, because like I said, we have reservations in like 30, 40 minutes. So we got this drink. It tastes really good. It's made with tequila. I forgot the name of it. And then we got some maki. Mm -hmm. I just turned into a sushi girl. You got to. Me. Barely. Cause, oh my gosh, it's not even. See how that would cane? Yeah. I might have to just be hood a little bit and pick it up with my hands. I was trying to have the aesthetics. reservation and they have like other seats I think I showed you guys like they have other seats but we're gonna sit on the day bed and they even have like chairs but we're about to sit right here and relax because it's so hot <laughs> this is all these menu um, we're gonna set our food we already ordered drinks we got the martini. I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah. And so we also do bottle service. Tequila. They got all that. On the beach. On this day bed. And it feels so good. Well, it feels good to be on the day bed. It don't feel good outside. It's hot. <laughs> if we be honest. But yeah. Whew, we're just about to relax. Might really take a nap out here for real. In the ocean. Oh, that feels so amazing. So pretty. Ooh. It's like the perfect temperature. I need to get my butt wet. I fell in the sand, y'all. <laughs> I fell in the dang sand. It's so pretty. Food at 
wasabi I got. Alfredo, roasted potatoes, a Wagyu, some maki. Got a drink too, but I drank it already. Fettuccine <laughs> Alfredo. Oof, I've been loving it. I love pasta. That's a lot. Creamy. Alright y'all, it's a little while. <laughs> It's a little while later, y'all. Um, a whole lot later, actually. And we're about to go eat dinner. We came back from Anguilla. It was so pretty, so nice. Um, now we're going to Sandbar because, ooh, baby, the humidity is humidity. Humidity. -ding -ding. <laughs> we're going to Sandbar because it's right next to the resort. So we're about to go. It's a vibe. It's a vibe all the time. Maybe say that outfit to whatever way you need to Alright, y'all. I didn't even say so. Alright, y'all. Last final night in St. Martin. And we're just about to chill. We're in the room. We're about to chill. I didn't show y'all much of like nightlife here, but nightlife. Um, in St. Martin is good, especially on the weekends. I feel like it's something always going on, like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Like, it's always something going on. So that's not something you'd have to worry about coming out here if you're looking for a good time. You could definitely find you a good time. Um, but I'm about to actually start packing up some of my stuff instead of, you know, going out. We went out yesterday, but I didn't record anything. Um, but yeah, I'll have... I'll try to put like the places that I found that you can like go to out here. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. I hope I showed enough. It, I know I didn't do like any excursions or stuff like that, but we did go to like three different, well, technically two different islands outside of St. Martin. So that was like our excursions, our, you know, what we wanted to do. We've already done like jet skiing, ATVs, horseback riding. So, you know, wanted to do something different and like get more stamps, of course. Um, but yeah, the trip's been really good. 